Hi guys, David and David here from payitforward.com and upphone.com and in this video we are going to explain what to do when your iPhone XS, XS Max, and XR won't charge. So when an iPhone won't charge it's a big deal because your kind of clock is ticking and you're running out of battery life and by the time you're watching this video your iPhone probably won't turn out at all. So the first thing we're going to do is the easiest fix and it's the first thing they do in an Apple store and it's a hard reset. Mm -hmm. So it's a little bit different process on different phones, but we're doing a 10s, 10r, 10s Max, and they're all the same. They're all the same. Perfect. So what you're gonna do is you're gonna tap the volume up button, tap the volume down button, and then press and hold the side button until the Apple logo appears on the screen. Yep, I'm just gonna keep pressing and holding. Could take you know 20 seconds, 25 seconds. Mm -hmm. In some cases, 30 seconds. Yeah, just don't give up. Because give up. a lot of the time, if it seems like it won't charge, what's actually going on is that it's stuck on a black screen. There you go, Apple right. logo. Yep, stuck on a black screen, the software crashed. So you're doing stuff, you're plugging it in, it's not doing anything, mm -hmm. but it's a software problem. So if the Apple logo appears on the screen, you have a software issue, and hopefully it's gonna be fixed for good. Yep. If not, there are other ways to fix that yeah, problem. Yeah, so our next step is to inspect your lightning cable. Right, there are a few things that are involved in the iPhone charging process. You got your lightning cable, you got the wall charger, you have the phone itself, the bottom of the phone. So. The first thing to do is just make sure that your cable itself isn't frayed mm -hmm. because it's not going to work if it's frayed. Yep. Most of the time it happens at one of the edges. Yeah. The easiest way to test this is try a different cable. Yep. Yep. And if you try a different cable, it doesn't work. Try a different charger, mm -hmm. um, you know, wall charger, USB port. Right. Whatever you want. You also could use a wireless charger since you have a 10S, 10S Max, or 10R. If you have one. Yep. And about cables. Apple cables are MFI certified, and so are some other brands, but not all. MFI stands for made for iPhone, and Apple builds in a chip to these types of cables that the iPhone recognizes, and it says to itself, hey, this is a safe cable for me to use to charge. If you're using a gas station cable that you bought for $2, and it's not charging, you definitely probably need to buy an MFI certified cable. Amazon has them, yep. uh, Amazon Basics brand. But be careful on Amazon because some of those aren't MFI certified. And one more thing about the non-MFI certified cables, usually you'll, you'll see uh, this accessory may not be supported on your iPhone mm -hmm. if it's not going to charge. So look out for that pop-up. Yep, and those cables break all the time yep. too. Mm -hmm. So we've checked our charger, we've mm -hmm. checked our cable, we've hard reset, nothing's working. What's our next step? It's to clean out the lightning port on your 10s, 10R, or 10s Max. You'd be surprised by how much crap can get in the bottom of your iPhone over the course of a day. This is probably the number one reason why iPhones don't charge. And the good news is that you can fix it at home. So to clean out this bottom port down here, you wanna use an anti-static brush. And if you're not a nerd and don't have an anti-static brush lying around, mm -hmm. you can use a toothbrush that you've never used before. Make sure it's one you've never used before because liquid's bad, obviously, and you know, yeah. it's also kind of gross to put your- Gross. Your, yeah, your I plaque on your, yeah. Exactly. Probably make the problem worse if you use a toothbrush you used before. Probably. So I'm just gonna, don't be afraid to get in here hard. And I mean, at Apple Store, people are like really gentle, but yeah. Apple Techs, if you're using something that's that's uh, soft, mm -hmm. it's not gonna cause damage in here. So you could just sort of brush it out. I'm sure that there's some gunk, although I have a pretty clean iPhone. With, so here's what not to do, right? Though, right? Yeah, perfect. Sorry, you were just gonna. Say yeah, that. I was gonna say, you know, don't stick anything metal in your port. Also, you know, avoid like toothpicks because those can splinter and get stuck, and that's that's no good. You heard it here first. Don't stick anything metal in your port. Yeah. What's next, David? Well, after that, and if your iPhone still isn't charging, let's do a DFU restore. DFU stands for Device Firmware Update. It's the deepest type of restore that you can do on an iPhone. Yeah. Firmware isn't hardware like the chart and charging port. Mm -hmm. It's not software like iOS. It lives in between the two and helps them to talk to each other. So it's the code in your iPhone that lets the charger know when something's plugged in, and if the firmware gets screwed up in your iPhone, it won't charge. So we do have a GFU Restore video. We sure do. We'll link mm -hmm. that in the description section down below in a card up above. Mm -hmm. And if the DFU Restore doesn't fix the problem, you're probably going to need to get your iPhone repaired. And there are some good options for this. The obvious choice, especially if your iPhone is under warranty and not damaged, is go to the Apple Store, make an appointment online, and hopefully they'll cover it under right. warranty. There, there are also some really good third-party repair shops. I'll send someone to you. Sometimes mm -hmm. there are mail-in services. We'll link to those in the description section below and a card up above. Yep, so that's what to do if your iPhone won't charge. Hope you guys enjoyed watching this video. Yep. For more great iPhone tips and tricks, make sure to check out our other YouTube videos. Yep. If you're shopping for a new cell phone because your iPhone won't charge, yep. check out upphone.com, which is the best place to compare any cell phone, every plan online. Yeah, don't forget to give this video a thumbs up. Leave yep. us a comment down below. Let us know what you think. And don't forget to subscribe to this channel and click the notifications bell to get an immediate alert when we upload a new video.